Hi everyone! Hi. Welcome Hi. to Crafts with Grace. I want to see my shirt. Oh, let's see your shirt. And my pants. Here's my shirt. And my pants are this at the bottom. Those are really pretty. Do you want to tell them what we're going to do for with Crafts with Grace today? Of course! What are we doing? We're making a loop. Yeah. We... So you're going to need a spoon. <laughs> okay, so we're going to skip to materials. All right, go ahead. So we're going to need a spoon and some green tish, um, what's that? Green cardstock paper, construction paper. Green stock construction. And two tissue papers. Different colors. White and pink. White and pink, you're gonna need how many of each? And some glue. How many Two, of um, Three of each. Three of each, and they don't have to be white and pink. You can pick whatever colors you want for the flowers. And then you're gonna need scissors. A pair of scissors. And then you're gonna need uh, some yellow paint. Yellow paint. And some white paint. White paint. And some teal paint. Light blue. And light blue. And, and a darker some blue. Pom poms. And some pom poms. Uh, don't forget this. And you need some glue. You're going to need a box for cardboard from a box. And some scissors and some glue. Yes. All right. So let's start doing it. Yeah, let's start doing it. Can we talk a little bit about what kind of lily pad we're going to do? Yes. So, a frog lily pad. Yeah, so the lily pad we're doing is um, inspired by Claude Monet, who is a French painter, um, which many of you know. Um, or he was a popular French painter, so he's Ford definitely household Monet, name. And, and I'm in a Ford, Ford Monet, Monet. And exactly. I'm in a Ford Monet quote, too. <laughs> I don't know if Claude Monet uh, designed your clothes, but close, right? He was known for his uh, his water lily sequences, right? And so we're going to do an art project today I inspired open. by him. Um, so are you ready to get started? Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Ready? Are we gonna do this? I just don't know how to open the teal paint. <laughs> it's okay, I can open it. I have scissors over here. All right, are you ready to do this? Yeah. Yeah. Let's start doing it. All right, so our first step is to take apart our box. Well, we have plenty of boxes because of uh, being at home so much. We've ordered a lot from Amazon, right? Alright, and then what we're going to do with our box, can I see? Thank you. Is we are going to just cut a side of it. Ta-da! And we're going to cut, oh it looks like we can just pull this side apart. Perfect. Um, and then from there we're just going to cut out. And then we're going to cut out a Pond and shape. we're gonna paint it too. We sure are gonna paint it. Okay, ready? Okay. So let's cut a pond shape. Here we go. Because <laughs> I just don't know what to do. I don't know what she's doing. What do you mean you don't know what I'm doing? Da 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 da! Does this look like a pond? Yes. Yeah, I think it so too. It looks like a duck pond. It does look like a duck pond. All so right. let's start getting to painting. Yeah, well, while we're at the box part, <laughs> what you're gonna wanna do is, um, um, just to prep after the, the painting, is to remove the first layer so that you can kind of see the, the corrugated pieces. So our next step, what we're gonna do is- Let's squirt the glue on. Yes, we are going to put all the different colors of um, the paint that we have. So the dark blue, the light blue, the white and yellow, and you're just gonna put them in random areas. All right? Can I put them on? You shook your hand. Let me give them a good shake. Okay. My name is Grace, this is Mom. <laughs> yes. All right, there's Make yellow. Make sure to go spell Grace and Mom channel. Yes. The next step is 
to take your spoon and spread the paint. going to be making the lily pads for our pond. Is these ones going to be on the pond? Yes, ma'am. So you're going to grab your construction paper. Um, we should trace them. And then you're going to cut them. Um, can you trace Do you want me to drum? Yeah, can you trace them? Yes. Double. So the, the best way I do lily pad leaves is like a heart, um, but whiter. But so. if child are cutting it, let's make it sure to draw do this draw the lily pad with a pen so it's more easier for the child so something like that all right and then once you have all three or however many you want to make you did them in all different sizes now you're just going to glue it on top even if it's wet it's fine if you guys Mom, can i do it a little on top. bit so there's that for you, Miss. Perfect. Good job. The next step is to add tissue paper lilies. Um, and then what you're going to do. Can I put them on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to cut out circles um, out of tissue paper and then you're gonna kind of layer two. So you can either do pink on the bottom, white in the middle, or white on the top, and pink in the middle, or alternate on. So we're going to cut those. All right, <laughs> once you're done cutting out all of your circles, three of each color, six total, um, you're gonna wanna get your palms, or your little buttons or whatever you're going to use for the middle. It could even be balled up yellow tissue paper. <laughs> you have in hand. There goes Grace again. Disappearing and reappearing like magic. Huh. Oh, craft time with Grace. All right, so the next step you're gonna do is you are going to either put white on the inside or pink on the inside. Um, and of course the other color will be on the outside. And then you're gonna take your palm and you're gonna put it right in the middle of the circle and you're just gonna mold your flower with the tissue paper around it and crinkle it so it kind of turns into a little ball and it gives you a little texture. Then you're gonna open it. I was gonna go get water, Vlog. We'll go get water. But I can't reach the straw. <laughs> Cause you want a straw? Should we pause and get you water? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna pause and get Grace water. Did you get your water? You feel better now? Uh -huh. Okay, good. All right, so for the final step, what you're gonna do is you are gonna take um, the middle of your tissue paper and you're just gonna put a little dot of glue. And up your this. <laughs> your new wand. And then with that dot of glue, then you're gonna place the pom-pom in the middle. Go ahead and place the pom-pom. the glue is. Good job. All right, which, uh, which lily pad would you like that to go on? That one? All right, now let's put glue. All right, go ahead. Awesome. All right, now let's do it for the other one. What color do you want on the outside on the next one? Yes, thanks everyone for joining us. Here's our end product. 
We hope you join us in a couple weeks for the next Craft with Grace and our special 4th of July edition that we'll be doing on 4th of July. Yeah, and it's gonna be really fun and it's gonna be red and blue. Red, white, and blue. Good job. All right, thanks everyone. It Bye. might be a flag. Ooh, maybe we'll do a flag. Are we saying bye? Yeah. Okay. Bye everybody. Bye everyone. Thank you for watching this video and make, hit the red button and it's bye. Bye.